Shalom, shalom. I'm going to start by giving your praise to Yahweh, by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, by Hashem, and Kakadash. I want to give that honor to the elders and apostles of Great Millstone, peace and blessings to the hopeful elect. My, uh, <clears throat> my name is Brother Napop from the Camp Prophets in Babylon and Tampa Bay. And I want to get into a short class. <clears throat> and I hope it's edifying to the uh, hopeful elect, you know, and, and, uh, brothers that are listening in. I want to get into a class, I'm going to call it. Um, this the the side effects of that serpent juice is starting to kick in. All right, because <clears throat> really, man, it is, man. It's, the side the side effects are starting to kick in, man. You know what I'm saying? For many for many people, it already started to kick in, there, man. But you know, for everybody, it's gonna really start kicking in, man. All right. But originally, where I got this this class from is because uh that video I posted right before um. Uh, Right before this class, you know, it was talking about how it was a lot of uh, plane crashes, man. You know, there's been many plane crashes, and the man was getting to one of them, and he was like, uh, the guy, he took that serpent juice, man. You know, and he had a uh, stroke in the middle of driving the plane, man. <clears throat> From that serpent juice, man, you know. So those side effects are starting to kick in, man. All right, that time is coming where you might see motherfuckers drop dead in front of you, man. You know, like how they try to portray uh, that damn fake ass cold, bro. That, 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 that damn uh, crown, crown royal. You know, they had people dropping dead and shit, man. You know, that's all. That all was an act, man. But what we're about to see ain't going to be an act, man. <clears throat> People are going to be going crazy, man. All right? I won't be surprised if it's a zombie apocalypse, man. All right? So I want to get Isaiah chapter 31 verse 1. It says, Woe to them that go down to Egypt for help. All right? So death and destruction to you that go down to Egypt for health, man. help, man. And Egypt is spiritually, um, uh, means bondage, man. You know? And this place, um, America, is our bondage, man. You know, and if you're going down to to your damn slave masters and shit, your slave owners and shit to them where you're in captivity at, you know, you ask them for help, man. What do you think they're going to do, man? They don't give a damn about you, man. All right. They ain't going to sit there and give you, give you the right antidote. They ain't going to give you the, the right uh, help. All right. They'll give you something that's going to benefit them, man. All right, so woe, death and destruction to you that trust in them Egypt, man. That go down to hell for Egypt, man. You know. It says, uh, and stay on horses and trust in chariots because they are many. And in horsemen because they are strong. But they look not unto the Holy One of Israel, neither seek the Lord. All right, man. They don't seek the Lord, man. God, they don't seek the Lord, man. They don't. They don't try to ask from help, for help from the Lord, man. You know, yeah, a lot of people, especially these damn Christians, man. I always talking about they fear the Lord, man. They fear the Lord, but they're the damn the first ones to get that thing, man. All right, they was the fucking first ones to get that shit, man. When the scripture says, "Don't make any cuttings or marking into your flesh," man. All right, and then you pin damn serpent juice inside you, man. Now your ass over there twitching and shit, and now you trying to figure out what the fuck is happening, man. The Lord is judging these people, man. All right, the Lord is the Lord is judging these people, man. All right, because they they didn't seek the Lord, man. What they did was seek help from Egypt. All right, because all, ultimately they have no faith in the Lord, man. <clears throat> because they don't believe in the Lord. All right, if they believed in the Lord, they would have they would have trusted in the Lord. They would never took that shit. All right. Uh, what's that one scripture? Um, no, I'm, uh, I'm gonna get it. But, you know, they they have no faith in the Lord, man. They don't have any be belief in the Lord, man. Give me one second. Come on, right here. This is 2 Corinthians chapter uh, 4, verse 18 says, While we look not at the things which are seen, but at the things which are not seen. For the things which are seen are temporal, but the things which are not seen are internal. All right, man, and that's 
ultimately having faith as well, man. You look at you look at toward the things that, you look not toward the things that are seen, you know, but the things which are not seen, man. You know what I'm saying? Because the things that are seen are temporal, man. All right, but things that are not seen are internal, man. All right, so we put our faith, we put our hopes into the things which are not seen, you know. And if you get into that, man, you know, we haven't seen the Lord yet, man. You know, but we have faith in the Lord. You know, we have faith in the Lord. We trust in the Lord. You know what I'm saying? We we believe the Lord will cure any sickness we have, man. As long as we do this work, as long as we strive for this truth, man, the Lord will will cure us from this shit, man. Anything we get, man. All right, that's that's having faith, man. But these damn Christians, these damn, especially these damn Jake, man. These Jake, you know, they have no trust in your own Lord, man. You know, the Lord, the Lord says that you're His special people, man. You know, but instead you go to the damn devil and you go take his damn serpent's juice, man. All right, what does a serpent do, man? What does a serpent has in his teeth, man? Poison. That poison ain't gonna do nothing but destroy your ass, man. That's ultimately what these damn Jake getting, man. And that's their judgment, man. That's the Lord judging them. All right? Because ultimately it wasn't for them. All right? Ultimately it wasn't for them to, to, to seek the Lord. Ultimately it wasn't for them to come back into the Lord. Ultimately it was for them to die in this damn place, man. All right? So let's get, um. I want to get Psalm chapter 83, verse 8. I'm mean, at 33, verse, um. Three, it says, They have taken crafty counsel against thy people and consulted against thy hidden ones. All right, so these damn Edomites, man, you know, they've, they've been planning this shit, man. All right, they've been planning this shit from the beginning, man. You know, and these damn Jake fell for it. All right, these Jake fell for it, man, because they ultimately they, they have no faith, they haven't studied the, the, the scriptures, they haven't been taught the scriptures the right way, man. All right. And they don't believe in the scriptures, man. So they they were easily, you know, deceived. And now look at their ass, man. Got guys having strokes on the airplane, people twitching and shit. You know, and that, that that's what that's what comes out of trusting in this devil, man. Alright? That's what comes in trusting in this devil, you know. Once he's uh we should I say peace and safety. Let me get that too as well, man. Real quick. Peace and safety. This is uh, 1 Thessalonians chapter 5 and verse 3. It says, For when they shall say peace and safety, then sudden destruction cometh upon them. As travail upon a woman with a child, they shall not escape. All right, so these damn Edomites have been saying peace and safety this whole time, man. All right, saying this serpent is just going to help you. This serpent is just going to secure you. You know, you don't got to worry about none of that shit. You know, as long as you get these damn booster shots, these damn all this shit, man. You know, <laughs> all this shit is going to help you, man. But that every month they're coming out with a new shot, man. If it was going to help you, man, the first shot would have helped your ass, man. Now look at your ass twitching this shit. Now you got to keep getting more booster shots. Now you're plaguing your body even more, man. All right, these damn devils said peace and safety, man. These devils said, all right, you, um, you take this damn serpent's juice, you good, man. All right, you trusting us, you going to be good. That's all, they, that's all they talk about, man. All right, and then you got stupid ass jakes. They're actually trusting that shit, man. You know, they have stupid ass jakes that actually believe that that shit is going to save them, man. They believe they, they believe in that thing wholeheartedly, man. More than they trust in the Lord, man. More than they have faith in the Lord. You want to know why? Because it, they, 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 they can see it, man. All right? Because they can see it, man. All right? But they, they don't see the Lord, man. Since they can't see the Lord, they, they don't have faith in the Lord, man. They don't believe the Lord is actually going to protect them, man. They ultimately don't believe in the Lord at all, man. All right. It says, uh, as travail upon a woman with child, and they shall not escape. All right. So it's going to be as travail upon a woman with a child, man. You know how a woman always scream and shit, man. That's how these damn uh, Jake's going to be, man. You know, that's how they are now, man. They getting plagued and shit. You know, they over there, um, a lot of people are weeping, man. A lot of people are crying, man. Because they started to figure out that these damn serpent juice ain't what it's, what it was said to be, man. Now they're starting to see changes in their bodies. Now they're starting to see changes in their family members' bodies. 
you know. They start to see a lot of changes, man. There's people, you know, I know personally, man, you know, and they told me it was like, uh, it was like, uh, how, how they, their, they are, uh, granddad died, man. It was, it was right after he took that damn thing, man. You know, I was like, damn, <laughs> I was like, damn, man. A lot of these damn, especially these damn old people, man. They, they. They go get it, man. You know, they body are they body already too weak, man. They ain't gonna be able to take all that shit that's in that serpent juice, man. You know, these damn old people ain't gonna be able to take it, you know. Their immune system weak, all that shit is weak, and the the serpent juice making it even more weaker, man. It's just it's, it's breaking it down even more. Alright? So let's get back to uh Psalm chapter 83 and verse 3. Let me get this one more time. It says they have taken crafty counsel against thy people. And consulted against thy hidden ones. Alright. So these damn devils have been sitting here playing this shit for years and years and years and years, man. Now they're starting to make their move. And they 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 getting some green checks right now, man. You know what I'm saying? That, that they they get some green checks right now, man. They 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 getting these Jake's ass, man. They getting Jake ass, man. You know, Jake's starting to believe in that shit. Jake's starting to trust in these damn meeting mics, man. But it's going gonna, it's gonna to come to the time where these damn devils really go show their horns. Then these jakes going to be looking fucking stupid, man. All right? And we ain't going to say, I told you so. <laughs> We're going to be too busy not even trying to bother with you. We're going to be avoiding your ass because you got down all that damn... You got a plagued ass body, man. Don't be around us with that shit, man. You know? All right? So I'm going to get uh, Galatians chapter 5 and verse... Um, 25 it says if we live in the spirit let also let us also walk in the spirit all right so if you if we live in the spirit man we're gonna walk we're gonna walk in also walk in the spirit man all right so what the spirit tells us to do we ain't gonna do it man and our spirit don't trust in that damn serpent juice man our spirit don't dwell in this damn world man our spirit don't do a lot of shit that all these these damn two-third jakes do man all right we walk in the spirit and we, we uh, listen to our spirit, man. All right? That's why, you know, these damn jakes and shit, they listen to their flesh, man. What they flesh tell them, tell them to do, man. That's all they listen to is what they flesh tell them to do. And right now, they flesh is telling them, hey, get that uh, thing, you know, if you want to keep your job. Get that thing if you want to keep going out there. The clubs and shit. Get that thing if you want to go see your favorite rapper rapping, man. That's what their flesh is telling them, man. All right? And now that's why they ass over there fucking having heat strokes. Uh, not heat strokes, but damn strokes on the damn floor and shit. Caesars on the floor and shit, man. You know? Because they trust in their flesh, man. They walk in their flesh, man. So whatever their flesh tell them to do, they go do it, man. All right? The flesh is contrary to the spirit, you know? The spirit telling you, nah, don't take that shit. That shit ain't right. You know what I'm saying? That shit is, is not, it's something not, it's, it's not right, man. Don't take it. But the spirit telling you, you want to go see the movies, right? You want to go to the movies, right? You want to go see your favorite rapper, right? You want to go out, out of state and stuff, right? Different countries and stuff, right? You got to take that thing. And you know what Jake do? They take that damn thing, man. They don't got this faith. They don't got this truth. They go straight ahead and take that damn thing, man. All right. Now let me get uh. Let me get uh. <clears throat> Proverbs chapter twenty nine verse twenty five. It says, "The wicked plot of against the just." All right, Slakia. Uh, that was the one I tried to. Uh, yeah, Proverbs chapter twenty nine verse twenty five. It says, "The fear of the man bringeth a snare, but whosoever putteth his trust in the Lord shall be safe." All right, so the fear of man bring up a snare, man. You know, and these these damn um, Jake, man, they fear, man. You know, they they ultimately, man, they 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 fear these damn Edomites, man. They fear the Edomites the more than they fear these damn uh, the, the more than they fear the Lord, man. All right, because the everything that the Edomites tell them to do, they do it. They on point with it, man. They make sure they do it. That's their priority, man. All right, but if the Lord tell you not to do it, they don't. They don't even listen, man. 
Everything you do is contrary to what the Lord says, man. To the scriptures. It says it brings a snare, man. You know? And that, that that's what got the ass over there taking that damn serpent juice. Now they over there damn you have pus bumps all over them and shit, man. Alright? It says, But whosoever put his trust in the Lord shall be safe. Alright, man? So we put our trust in the Lord, man. Do you see our ass over there having strokes, man? Do you see any any news saying uh Hebrew is light? You know, with the right doctrine, of course. And the right faith. Hebrew is like having a stroke. Nah, man. You don't see that shit, man. You know, all the brothers, you know, we all straight, man. You know, when we get sick, man, we, we quickly are healed, man. All right? I was just sick last week, man. You know, that shit's gone. You don't know why? Because I put my trust into the Lord, man. All right, that's what we brothers do, man. We don't give a damn about that damn serpent truth, man. They can go show that shit up their ass, man. That ain't our problem, man. We ain't touching that shit. The Lord told us not to touch that shit. You know, the scripture told us not to fuck with that shit, man. We ain't fucking with it, man. The spirit told us not to fuck with that shit, man. We're not fucking with it, man. All right? <clears throat> and that's just how it is. That's how it's got to be, man. That's how it's got to be. That's why That's why we, um... That's why you always see, you know, the man, the man of the Lord, man. We always... We always you know, in and, and good spirit, man. You know what I'm saying? We're in good spirit. You know, we have healthy bodies. We're healthy. You know, ain't shit happening to us. Because the Lord keeps us safe, man. The Lord cures us. The Lord is our medicine, man. You know, He cures us from any sickness. You know, anything that happened to us, man. As long as we keep our faith. As long as we keep our trust into Him. You know what I'm saying? Keep the right faith. You know, the Lord got us. You know what I'm saying? So we ain't gotta worry about none of that other shit, man. We don't gotta be worried about none of that other shit. Like these damn eating by sand, man. Tell what they got to say, man. The Lord got us. Alright? That's all I'm gonna get on that. I'm gonna give our praise to Yahweh. By Shem Yahushai, by Shem Kakadash. Peace and blessings to the hopeful elect. Shalom, my friend. Hope this class was edifying to you, brother. And to the, ho uh, and to the hopeful elect. Shalom.